row upon row of cat trees cover this farm in Meru, Kenya. The plant is the economic mainstay here, as well as the counties of Isiolo and Taraka Nithi. Also known as Kathonin and Miralt, the cat crop now finds itself in a controversy. What do you Negative attitude against Miralt. People have a negative opinion towards cat, even though it's not harmful. It is just a stimulant like any other, similar to coffee, tea. When you chew cat, you can work for a long time without getting tired. In 2014, it was classified in the UK as a Class C drug and banned. Risk cited were low attainment family breakdown and some users feeling cut off from society. When I saw that the UK and Somalia had banned cat, yet I had not planted any other crop, I chose to begin planting sunflowers. I found an advantage in sunflowers as it allows me to feed my animals. When I make some money from it, I pay for school fees and use the remainder to buy food. I have done this because there is no alternative and my piece of land is small. Before the 2014 ban, the UK imported up to 2,800 tons of cat a year, mainly from Kenya, Ethiopia and Yemen, according to a report from the UK's Advisory Council on the Misuse of Drugs. The first onslaught on the crop was um, uh, Theresa May. Now she was then the health minister. Uh, due to pressure from some lobby groups who um, claimed that um, uh, the Mira tweaks and uh, and, uh, and 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 um, and and banana fibers were were dirtifying um, uh, and polluting the uh, UK. Then they put pressure on the government to ban it. So it was not banned because it was a drug. It's because there were other. In Kenya, cat is classified as a drug by the National Authority for Campaign Against Drug Abuse. The bitter leaves of cat, many say, have a stimulant effect when chewed. Some have said that it raises their energy levels.